After more than two decades, the Tobago Arts Festival is back. This festival features a wide range of art genres, including music, dance, film, fine art, literature, and poetry. This year's theme is Winston Bailey, an ode to his creative genius. Cheryl Ann Solomon, administrating the Division of Education, Innovation and Energy, says she's happy to see the arts place on the front burner once again. The Tobago Schools Arts Festival is a vision emanating from the Division of Education, Innovation and Energy and forms part of the Tobago House of Assembly's vision to use cultural arts as a vehicle to drive, among other things, social change, alternative industry, and cultural transitioning. In keeping with the division's mandate to boost education in all sphere, Chief Secretary Kelvin Charles, who is Education Secretary, says such cultural experience will foster holistic development in Tobago students. Arts in general, and arts in education more particularly, must be seen as an ideal avenue to nurture and develop the skills and talents of each child and connect them with their culture and with the wider world. Through this festival, students will showcase their talent through various forms. It will have other benefits. For the boys and girls, our children, the Arts Festival provides a perfect opportunity to build their self-confidence social and emotional skills, strong language competencies, critical thinking, and indeed, their creativity and imagination. The arts can also be a way out of poverty. Arts provide tremendous opportunities for lucrative careers, as was demonstrated by the Mighty Shadow and other artists, local, regional, and international. The festival will be held later on this month at various schools across Tobago. I'm Crystal George for Let's Talk Tobago. This has been your Tobago Notes.